Hello, and welcome back to my Dragon Slayer. Or if you're new here, welcome to my Dragon Slayer. If you would like to subscribe, that'd be, that'd be nice. Today I'm going to be looking on Trend Mood and just going over some of the things that really look intriguing to me as far as makeup. Last time I did skincare and since then they've came out with like a million other things that I wanna mention, but I've already done a skincare one. I'll do another one, but today I'm focusing mostly on makeup. I say mostly, I'm, I'm focusing on makeup today. The first thing that caught my eye when it came to makeup is the Natasha Denona Glam Palette. I don't have any full-size Natasha Denona palettes. I only have like the, the mini ones. And this one looks so, oh my gosh, it looks so cool. It's just a lot of uh, cool tones. It says it includes 15 cool and neutral shades with matte metallic sparkling finishes. Natasha named the shades after their ideal place to apply them to make it easy to create any eye look or recreating her glam makeup looks. And it's coming in at $65. So that's the price of her bronze palette was $65. And, but I still never got that one either. This one looks really pretty as far as just everyday colors. I mean, you could take some of these colors here. Like as you can see, it says on here, you've got center eyelid, outer eyelid, crease, transition, blend brow bone. Really, you could use these however you want, but like they said, she made this palette kind of giving people who are just starting with makeup, maybe kind of a, here's where you should put this. Here's where you should put this, but, but yeah, that's the first one. The second one that caught my eye is this Friends X Revolution, and I really thought this was cool that they're coming out with a Friends uh, collection. My sister-in-law loves Friends. I mean, it doesn't say a whole lot about it. Um, just that they're having a new collaboration and they're obsessed with the classic iconic TV show. This is going to be neat. I, I can't wait to see what they come out with. That looks cool. I don't know what else to say about it besides it looks really cool. All it is is a picture of Friends and then Re <laughs> X Revolution at the bottom and everyone's like, Arr! including me. The next thing that really caught my eye was the Melt Digital Dust Duo Blushes. And it says that these are a luminous, multi-use, revolutionary blush duo in the coveted Skin Perfection Digital Dust Formula. It says a luminous, multi-use, revolutionary blush duo in the coveted Skin Perfecting Digital Dust Formula Buildable allows you to go from natural dewy, dewy flush to having an intensified luminous look. The compact features two buzzworthy shades that can be used alone or mixed for a customized radiance. They're $39 each. And they have Queen Bee, which is a warm bronze and honey gold. They have Raw Honey, that's mauve bronze and pink beige. And then they have Buzzkill, that is a coral nectar and peach champagne. Raw Honey is the one that really calls my name the most. That one is gorgeous. And I just like the little little stamp that's in there that's shaped like a honeycomb. Like that's not gonna go away after a while after you use it so many times. The next one was weird, for, I don't know. This, the Urban Decay, the Stoned Collection, I'm not as attracted to the eyeshadow palette. I am more attracted to these lip glosses because they just look so neat. They're in a, um, as you can see, they're in like a gem-shaped, component. So I, I just think that's, that's cool. I really like that purple. It looks like it's purple. These are going to be $18 a piece. They're high shine with multi-dimensional shimmer, sheer color, sparkling iridescence, and vanilla mint scent in shade light vibes, power high, and mercury RX. And I guess mercury RX, I'm guessing is that purpley colored one. And that one looks pretty to me. They all look pretty to me. I just like the component mostly. Pay $18 for some damn gloss just because it comes in a cool component. The next collection that really caught my eye was the Chantecaille 
fall collection. And this is the Elephant Inspired Trio of Safari Shades that was created to celebrate and support them. The collection supports space for giants and their vital work protecting Africa's elephants and the landscapes they depend on. And the collection includes the Safari Collection Eye Trio. Um, it says each shade is embossed with an elephant and embellished with a shimmering tonal overspray. $75. So you've got Selenki, which is a burnished gold, red earth, which is a strong copper, and Nanu, which is a soft taupe. Looks pretty to me, I tell you. And then you also have the Lip Veil Supporting Space for Giants. And it is a hydrating and luminous lip veil. And it's enriched with sustainable Fair Wild Certified Organic Baobab Oil. That's how it looks to me anyways. To leave lips luxuriously soft and smooth, $48. And that's just for probably one, <laughs> $48. I'm guessing that's just one. Yeah, I like the collection. I'm, I'm more um, about the eyeshadow palette because I just feel like I would get more use out of that than spending $48 on one lipstick. My grandmother loved elephants. She, has, she had a whole collection of all these different statues and not statues, a statue would make it sound like it was a giant like statue out in their yard, figurines of uh, elephants. And she had ivory ones. She had all these different really pretty elephants. And so every time I see anything elephant, I want it because of my grandmother. Chantecaille all already has a blush that has an elephant on it. I just haven't got it yet because it's like $50. The next thing that this one specific shade of this was like, wow, when they showed the pictures of it. What is it, you might ask? That is the Natasha Denona Chromium Liquid Eyeshadows. And my favorite one to me was Scarab. And it's like a green, gold, blue. It is, it's more green than anything. But when I saw the pictures online of the models wearing it, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so pretty. It says these provide a water-rich jelly texture with a fresh hydrating feel while leaving an unparalleled multi-chrome finish. Color changing at different angles due to the light reflection. They're $28 each. They just look so pretty. <laughs> They're so pretty. And I, I might actually get one of those. The next one is these Fenty Beauty uh, Pro Kiss Lip Balms. I, I love, so I mean, so far I have not been disappointed by Fenty's lip products. Lipsticks, liquid lipsticks, lip balms, lip glosses. For these lip balms, I, I'm super excited. I wanna get one, if not all of those. And those are shea butter formula that locks in moisture, they're buildable, and they have a subtle vanilla scent for $18 each. They have Pinch Me, with a, which is a sheer pink, Coco Drizzle, that's a sheer chocolate cool tone nude, and Latte Lips, that is a sheer neutral pink. The other thing that I'm seeing in this picture that really um, stuck out to me too is this eyeshadow palette in number 10. The greens and golds and all that that's in that palette, it looks so pretty. This is just called Money, and it has six vivid pops of creamy forest green shades and it's $25. These palettes are, they're both, they're 25 bucks each, so. This one is the, that was just revealed, and this is the Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Setting and Refresh Spray. So I love the, the Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Primer too. This is a dual phase setting and refreshing spray that sets makeup, hydrates skin, and provides a classy glow, 18 and $36 going to be from the mini in the full size. It features two layers, blue agave extract, grips and sets makeup, green cannabis glow phase. The spray forms a weightless invisible layer to grip and set makeup for up to 12 hours. It can also be used before makeup application to prep skin. Hemp derived cannabis seed extract, hyaluronic acid, aloe and niacinamide, blue agave grip phase. Hydrate, refresh and provide antioxidant benefits throughout the day for blissed out skin. I almost said blessed. Either way, hemp derived cannabis seed and moringa seed oils, green cannabis glow phase, add an extra shot of hydration to lock in moisture and provide a visible 
breathable, glassy glue. That looks exciting. Now this one, my husband's gonna watch this video and go, <laughs> no, you're not. I really want to get this. This is the Charlotte Tilbury. This is the new additions to the Pillow Talk and Walk of No Shame family. And it includes a jewel pot in Walk of No Shame for $35. Copper red cream eyeshadow with a divine golden sparkle. That's what intrigues me out of all this is that it looks so pretty. I, I keep saying it looks so pretty. The YouTubers I've watched that have put it on. Michelle Wong, Mel Thompson. You know, it looks so pretty. I love it. It's just so exciting. German, 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 German. Then you got the Jewel Lips Hydrating Plump Effect for $32. You have Walk of No Shame Ruby Red Glittering Lip Gloss that's adorned with a warm copper sparkle. I don't know why I said copper right there like that. Copper Pillow Talk Pink Glittering Lip Gloss with a Rose Gold gold sparkle with hyaluronic acid to flood the lips with plump effect moisture and hydration. That jewel pot, that little eyeshadow, that's what's really, really taking it there. The other thing that intrigued me is this Benefit Brow Micro Filling Pen. And I love anything that'll make me look like I have flipping brows without making it look like I drew them on with a marker. Right now I'm using the combination of Glossier products and Benefit products. And I'll, I'll have all that linked down below what I'm wearing. But yeah, I wanted to try this, but I've heard some people say that it feels like it runs out. I've kind of had that problem with a lot of things, unless it's a pencil, an actual, you know, cream pencil. So it says that the brow microfilling pen Eyebrow pen for micro fine hair like strokes. Create the illusion of natural brow hair with three ultra fine lines in a single stroke. It's designed to blend in with existing hairs, fill in gaps, and make brows appear where before there were none. The easy to apply formula of this brow pen looks natural and is waterproof, smudge proof, and long wearing, creating a microbladed effect that lasts for 24 hours. Three prong tip with three different lengths mimics natural brow hair, a sheer tint formula that comes in four shades that flatter warm, cool, and neutral undertones, $25 each. And this is coming in blonde, light brown, medium brown, and deep brown. And this has already been available, but if you're watching my video and you're going, they've had that out for a while, I know, but I just now started doing these trend mood videos. So, okay, I'm having to go back a while. The last thing I'm gonna bring up so this video isn't nine million years long, I'm gonna to have to already edit out enough. This is the Tiny Marbles. This is the collaboration with Sydney Grace and Mel Thompson palette. And it comes with 15 different shades and finishes for $52. And I don't have any Sydney Grace um, palettes or shadows or anything yet. And I've heard they're so good. They're so, I don't know why I said it like that. Jeez, calm down. Um, I've heard they are really good eyeshadows. Amazing, amazing quality. I want to try them and I love Mel Thompson. So I would love to be able to support her and buy her eyeshadow palette because it just, it looks gorgeous. That was everything for today. If you like these little trend mood videos, me just talking about the things that I thought looked nice. Um, you can give this video a like and I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.